Welcome to my Golden Games, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. This episode, John Marston has a mission for us, so let's go over to him and speak with him. I guess he's behind this tree over here. So hopefully you guys will enjoy this episode. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Hit that like button maybe as well. Uh, so let's get up here and see what John's got. It looks like he's got a map. We going treasure hey, hunting, John? Hey, what's going on, John? What's up? What do you want? Uncle told me something about Marine a train. <sighs> What did he say? Mary Beth overheard something about a train full of wealthy folk rolling down through Scarlet Meadows just right. south of the state border. Yes. You need help with it? I ain't even sure about doing it. Come on. At night, not too guarded, it's perfect. Nah, I ain't thought it through. <laughs> you know, stopping a train, pain in the ass. Sure. But what if we could force a train to stop? <laughs> well, of course. We get a wagon full of something flammable, oil. Ooh. Put it on the tracks. They see it. They know they either have to stop or die. Ain't no train driver wants to be cooked alive. That is kind of brilliant. That it is. Uh, for you. <laughs> <laughs> and that is a real idea. I think that's the first time you ever had one of them. <laughs> Shut up. You <laughs> might be the first bastard to ever have half his brains eaten by a wolf and end up more intelligent. It. So we're doing it? Yeah, we're gonna need ammunition, guns, look real frightening, and some dynamite to open up the train. I'll get the supplies. Gotta head into town for Abigail anyway. Don't even ask. You go find us an oil wagon. Yeah, I know just the place. They're always heading into that refinery. There's an old rundown shack just over the border, north of a place called Dewberry Creek. Leave it hidden somewhere near there. Roger that. All right, sounds good. Sounds like we got a good plan going. All right, so let's get on our horse sentinel. Right, let's get right over this way. Wagons that can be stolen for John are blipped with the wagon wheel. Okay, roger that. Hey, sentinel, good boy. Yeah, good horse. All right. You're a good boy. Let's get going. And load up. All right, John, see you out there. Careful. So let's see, there he goes off. Let's see. Where do we want to head out to? We got a wagon over here. Cornwall oil wagon. We got one over here. That's right inside town. I don't think I want to do that. So we will go over here. Looks like it's more secluded over here. So we'll head over this way. So we will cut that a little bit a second ago there. All right, John, take it easy. Yep. Head out this way and go get the stagecoach. All right, here we go. So it looks like this is the location up here, right on the railroad tracks. I'm guessing this is probably going to be some pretty good guards around here. Yeah, we got a guard right here, so let's see if I can speak to the guy. Howdy, mister. Can I speak with you for a second, dude? Take it easy. Hey, take it easy, man. Hey, I just need to speak with you for a second, okay, man? You better get going now. Sorry. Okay, I'll get going. I'll, I'll get going. Hey, guys, get over here. Hey, oh, no. guys, it's all right, guys. It's all right. I'm leaving. No, I'll stop it now. I'm leaving, all right? I didn't put a window in your skull. Okay, okay. It's uh, right off this way. Hopefully they don't see us. Are they still watching me? Are they that smart? They could be. They could very well be. Alright, so we're gonna have to go around this way. Let's see. There's a guy right there as well. Damn. Let's uh, get off here. I'll get my knife out. Right there. Um, I'm gonna have to do it. Let's do it, boys. That was a bad shot. You're dead, bitch. Get down, get down on the ground, LSPD. Down on the ground. 
Fifteen dollars for that? What? Okay. Well, that sucks. It didn't actually load. Because I guess technically we're still in uh, open world. Um, let's see. Let's get my bandana on. And let's go back to my horse because he's got my weapons on it. I probably should have done that first. Let's grab my weapons. So let's go over here. Hey, Sentinel. Good boy. All right. Let's see. Horse weapons. Let's get my carbine, and we'll get my Springfield. There we go, beautiful. So, since I got my Springfield, I don't believe I have a scope on it. Are those guys guards? Hopefully, they're just workers. Let's see. I'm gonna hide up over here, and uh, bop, I'm dead. Oh, man. Ah! Oh, there's a guy up there. That's not good. Come on, come on. Ah! Let's see. We got another guy there. Oh, got him. We're loading. Ah! Ah! Nope. 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 That's not good. That's not good. Shoot. Let's take cover over here. Uh, let's switch over here. We will get moonshine. Uh, we'll do this. Fully resourced offense kit. You don't mess with the wrong fellas. Dead. Straight up just dead. And the Springfield is beautiful, but I don't have much ammo for it. There we go. Headshot on that guy. I don't think I'm doing this properly here because I am losing a lot of stamina, or uh, a lot of my reputation. Uh-oh. Where's he at? Oh, Ow. A in that. Oh. Shoot. Oh. Shoot. Where's he at? Where's he at? Let's get my dead eye on this guy. Where is he? I don't even see him. There we go. Gotta be. Oh, shoot. Ow. Get down on the ground, bitch. Oh, come on. Come on. Get him. There we go. Ow! Shoot! Uh, let's eat something else. Uh, nope. Don't want that. Uh, we'll have another health cure. There we go. There we go. He's dead. Shoot! Come on, reload. Man, there are way too many guys here. They, like, keep spawning or what? Pop him off. Did I not get him there? Shoot. Oh, no. Now I got lawmen all over the place. I should have probably gone into the town. That would probably would have been better. Dead. I think I'm gonna get this done. Nope, dead. I've decided to reload the game because I lost a bunch of stamina and a lot of money doing that. We're gonna go into town this time because there's probably, what, two guards there, I'm guessing. It's in town. We tried to go to their actual, you know, facility where they just had, like, an army there. So, bad idea on my part. So, let's go into the town. I'm gonna change up my outfit really quick because I really like the outfit I got on in. You know, I don't want people to know who I am when I go and rob this place. Okay, guys, we are getting inside the town now. And I believe the wagon should be right up here. There it is. So, is it right for the Taken? I don't see any guards. Excuse me, boys, excuse me. Let's see. I'm going to just stake it out really quick before I do anything. don't see anybody. There's one guy right there. Let's see. Let's go around the back. Make sure there's no other guards. Looks clear. 
All right, so there's one guy up there. So I think I need to get my mask on. And let's just go right around here. And let's load up. Nobody sees me. Hey, what the hell? Excuse me, boys. Yes. Oh, shit. He's shooting at me, son of a bitch. Move, move, move. Go, 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 go. Okay. Yikes. The guy did decide to pull a gun on me. Started shooting at me. Hopefully he didn't poke a hole in the oil truck. Okay, I think we're good. You don't see anything, dude. You don't see anything. Right, we should be clear. Um, I guess I could take my mask off now. Take my mask off. There we go. That should be good. All right, so we're going to head up this way, I guess, and go deliver this wagon. Let's get this oil wagon delivered. Some deer up here. Move out of the way, deer. Move, move. Let's go. Whoop, 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 whoop. Supposed to go this way. My bad. My bad. Uh, let's cut it around this way. I thought we were going to be taking it into the stable, but apparently not. So let's uh, carefully. Where the heck does he want us to deliver this thing? I do not want to flip it. Yep. Carefully turn it around this way. There we go. And let's get it through here. Okay. This is the location here. Beautiful. Nice burnt out shed. That is a nice looking house. Too bad it burnt down. Uh, can I back this thing up? All right, let's store it right here. And there we go. That should be good. Good horsey. Good, good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Looks like good. I don't know why he let the horses go. We should have stabled them because now we have to use our own horses to pull it. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter. We're just ditching it there. Tell John back at the camp. Okay, so it looks like we gotta head back to the camp, and then we'll continue the mission. I found this wild horse out in the plains. Decided to pick him up, and now we got a stranger up here. So let's go see what's going on. Hello, Miss. What's going on? Because if they did, they can get lost. I have never been so insulted in all my life. Really, laughed at. Balderdash. Is that a dinosaur Are bone? Are you quite certain you're not a spy? Those wretches will do anything to destroy me. My theories are correct, and I can prove it. What's I am the leading amateur paleontologist oh. in the nation, and not one university will hire me because, unlike them, I actually have ideas. <laughs> you're a what? I study dinosaurs. You know, big lizards. Are they real? Of course they're real, you nincompoop. And everywhere. Everywhere? This state was once a vast, shallow sea that had the most incredible animal that could walk, swim, and fly. Quite unique. I call it Totalisaurus. Just for now. <laughs> um, I'm trying to gather all the evidence. Miss Deborah McGinnis. Nice right. to meet you. Good to meet you. Uh, could you give me a hand here, please? Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah. That is Listen, a big bone. If you find any of these bones around the country, send them to my homestead at Furwood Rise in Cumberland Forest. Or Yikes. mail me the locations. I'll reward you handsomely for your efforts. Okay, it sounds like sure. a deal. Thank you. Why not? And we'll be proving a lot of stuck-up buffoons very, very wrong. Which, trust me, is the very best thing about science. <laughs> Good day to you, sir. Good day to you well, ma'am. Find the dinosaur bones and mail their locations to Deborah. That is awesome. <laughs> All right, so let's get on our wild horse here that I broke in. And I was probably going to sell it. But uh, right now, I'll store it in case I need it for later. It's a pretty nice looking horse, I gotta say. All right, so the camp is right around the corner here, so let's get right over there. Yeah! Beautiful horse. 
Again, it doesn't have a saddle because my main horse is still behind me there. So let's get inside the camp. And I'm not sure if I can keep this horse at the camp or not, or what's actually going to happen to it once I uh, hitch it to the house. What are you doing, Javier? It's me. me. So let's get inside the camp here. I'll hitch this horse and then get my main horse. I wonder if I can actually just like deliver our camp horses to use. That would be good. Like just donate the horse to the camp. It's coming through, coming through. And let's hitch this horse. Still reading. Alright, so you've bonded with this horse and another spun to whistles. Okay. Now, here's my main horse, Sentinel. Good boy. All right, let's get him over here. I'm just going to hitch him really quick, and then we'll go talk to John. Ah, let's hitch him up right here. All right, good boy. Can't pet him? That's weird. Okay. Did you see that woman Mary Gillis about? Yes. Yes, I did. I never liked her. I know. You already told me that. <laughs> Ideas above her station. Above anyone's station, that one. All right. Well, let's get over to John Marston. Hey, John, I got it delivered. John? Let's get on. Good. Morning you? Fourth Oil 3. Got everything we need. Good. I think we need another man. Charles? I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. Sure. See, Arthur? Ain't that dumb. Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. <laughs> then you'll be a genius. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. <sighs> okay, guys, so I'm gonna leave this episode here. We'll probably pick up the next episode once we unlock that mission. It looks like we have to go speak to a few more people before we can actually go and do that mission. So I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. Have a great day, guys, and see you next time. And be sure to hit that little bell icon on the channel. That way you stay notified when the videos do go up. Take it easy, guys, and maybe consider subscribing. See you later, guys.